Hey! <laughs> hey guys! How you doing? Are you good? <laughs> so we are in a new location today. We are in my kitchen. The bakey is baking. And honestly, this is probably all I can be trusted with. Oh my god, that clock is ticking. How dare it click? <laughs> I've literally just took a battery out of a clock to stop it ticking during my video. <laughs> so if you guys didn't know, I love anything Oreo. There's another clock. It's back! Honestly, it's like the stop two episode with the clock work. As I was saying, I love anything Oreo. Oreo, 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 Oreo. So I was on Amazon at like 3am in the morning and I was scrolling through and it recommended me something which I wanted to try. And when Bakey wants to try something, she has to film it. This is from America and it is Jellio Oreo. Jelly Oreo, you say? I've just got to try it. Instant pudding and pie filling. Like I said, I adore Oreos, but Oreos are one of those things that shouldn't taste nice, but is nice. It's like when you drink Coke, it's black, it's fizzy, it just shouldn't taste good, but it tastes good. It's the same for Oreos, like they taste burnt, but in a good way. I'm honestly so excited to try this. Like, I'm not a foodie person, but I might be a foodie person. I'm so fussy, but love to try things. Like, this is really exciting me. So, what we need to make this instant whip, I think this is kind of like instant whip. Five minute pudding, two cups of cold milk, beet pudding mix, okay? And milk with a whisk for two minutes. I have to beat the milk as well. Put it all set soft in five minutes. It says two cups. We don't do that as measurements in the UK. We do milliliters, so I have no idea what two cups is. That could be a pint cup, that could be a half pint cup, that could be a mug, that could be a shot glass. One cup is 250 milliliters. Two cup is a pint, a pint of milk. So 500. By the way, whilst I'm here, I just wanna say thank you so much for the support on last week's video. The last two have been 20 minute vlogs and you guys seem to be really enjoying just my life and whatever I come up with. And now we're making Oreo pudding. Who knows what to expect anymore? I love it. 500 milliliters of milk. I want to know if this actually is a pint because there's no way that's a pint. Two cups or one pint? That shouldn't have made me that impressed. Let me know in the comments down below if you like to drink milk just because nothing beats a nice glass of milk. All right, here is the Oreo mix. Rip it off. Oh, 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 Oreo in the eye. Oh my God, that looks beautiful. It's all like cookies and cream. Who would have thought? Oh, oh, there is big chunks of Oreo in there. It's almost like it's Oreo. Get over here, let me show you what I'm about to do. So here is my Oreo mix. You can see there's little chunks of Oreo. We're gonna add the pint. Oh, ASMR. Lovely jubbly. Now we whisk. For how long? Five minutes? Do I do it viciously? Viciously whisk. How does one beat? Two minutes. Oh! Right, I'm gonna speed it up till two minutes. Ready? Three, two, one, go. We're done, but it's getting thicker, but it's still very liquidy. But with the power of time and five minutes, it should be thick. Oh yes, you're thick. Right, we're gonna leave this for five minutes to hopefully set and be thick. I don't know why, I don't know why I'm saying it in that voice. Right, gonna leave this to set for five minutes. While I do that, I'm gonna show you my broom and what it looks like right now since the last vlog. I haven't really changed much, but might as well kill time. Right, so I'm actually getting new carpet in my room very, very soon. Uh, so I've got a lot of rugs at the moment, but that will soon change. And it's actually tidy. Look at Baby keeping up with it. So since the last vlog, I moved the David Tennant picture from there. Um, I moved the Joker picture from there. So the play button was over there. The Joker picture was there, but now there. And now the David Tennant picture was there, but now over there. So that fits a lot better, I feel. I bought this Jurassic Park picture, which I put behind the door, because I just think it looks very clean. And then we got the Dementor up there. See, only little changes. But like I said, I'm going to have new carpet in here. So I'm going to have to take everything that's on the floor out. Last thing before we go downstairs and check the pudding. Um, so I rotate my wardrobes a lot with new designs. And this dark mark 
is the oldest one. So I feel like it's time to change the dark mark. Let me know in the comments down below what design you want me to do on my wardrobe. I love this one. We've obviously got the one in Elvish. So let me know what you think I should do with that wardrobe. That's a future project though, but still, let me know in the comments. Right, it's time to check on the Pud Pud. Do you think it's set? Should we ask it if it's set? Are you set yet? Oh, oh it wobbles. I wasn't meant to try it already. Let's show you the wobble. Oh yeah. Right, here we are with the Oreo pudding. Um, if this doesn't taste nice, I'm gonna be very disappointed. Don't ruin Oreos for me, darling. Oh yeah, it's just mousse. This might be very anticlimactic. Oh. Hold up, I need another one. Sorry. I'm half annoyed that it's good because now I've got this whole gigantic bowl I'm gonna want to eat, but also It makes it worth it Oh, mm. That is sexy this is beautiful It's so strong it is me thinking it's gonna taste milky and very light not much flavor It is very flavoursome. It's very Oreo. You don't have to worry about that. And the best part is there is chunks of Oreo throughout. That is good. But like everything from America, I feel like this could get very sickly very quickly. If I turn into a food reviewer, what is happening? Yeah, I feel a bit sick already to be honest. Mm. Right, that's how much I've ate and I feel sick. But there is so much you could do with this. I feel like you could make, it said pie filling on it. But they also said there was a recipe to make like ice pops with it. Like stick a stick in it and then freeze it. Might put some of these in the freezer actually, an ice cube tray. Or it needs like chocolate fingers with it. No, like, okay, of course I get really British with my, we need some chocolate fingers to dip in. But this Oreo Jellio is, uh, out of five, I'll give it... A 4.5. Don't really know what to do with it. Like, I can't just eat spoonfuls of it like that. But there's nothing wrong with the taste. Whoo! Okay, I'm gonna put you in the fridge. Note to self or editing bakey watching this, make sure you put the battery back in your mum's clock. Right! Don't know why I feel like I have to end the video up here, but that is it for the video. I know it was a super short one compared to my last two vlogs, but not much happened this week and I did a lot last week. So yeah, I hope you just enjoyed this random video, food review, whatever you want to call it. If you did, give a big thumbs up. Go in the comments down below, let me know your feedback because I love, 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 love reading comments. It's my favourite thing to do. Hit that subscribe button for more videos from me and I'll see you very, very soon with another video. Bye!